Hello everybody, I am Brim19 and welcome to episode number 14 of our Mawar Never Changes campaign achievement run in European Versailles 4. As we've just beaten Delhi a little bit, we took uh, Churi, Jangladesh, Delhi itself, and the Upper Doab, and we have now gotten Kalpi as well. Uh, we're just basically going to use this uh, to our... Can I spend that money? Yeah, I'm going to spend that money a little bit of admin to get every single one of these guys down even further. Yeah, I'm not super worried about it. Let me take a look at my war exhaustion. 0.49, it's really overextension, that's the problem. Yeah, we're beating, you know, we're going to clock in here and basically be blocking off Bengal from going any further west into this good territory. We'll have to go against Gara or Ratampur, which I think are all friendly to uh, not only us, but some others as well. Uh, mission fulfilled, we're waiting on that one. Let me see here. Uh, let me t have a little chit chat with you. I need to give you economy. Well, let me see subjects. You, you are giving me 0 0.09. I need to give you the equivalent of oh, not covert. It is give subsidies. That should be fine for the first little while and we'll see how you do. He needs to start making colonies of his own. Not just building up some troops and some ships. And it looks like he did. Okay, so why Tatha is his uh, is a province he decided to make into his his capital. So he's going to probably focus on uh, New Zealand first, which is fine. We're focusing here. I'm going to spend a little bit on shipboarding, and I'm going to check out two temples. Three workshops. No good marketplaces. Barracks, no. Training fields, though. One, two, three. There's two more I can do. We need to up the manpower. Fars declared war on Sindh. We should be getting ready to do the same thing to take this stuff. Yeah, we'll be taking that and taking that. I declared war. Oh, I shouldn't worry about that anyway. So I can't do it until I do this, which gives me the morale of armies that I want. That's over in Gara. I don't really care. It doesn't even lead to anything else. More in Delhi. Which will be leading to more in Bengal too. That's just Delhi. Sin, this is about as far out as I think we'll get to go. You need to get higher discipline. What is my discipline at right now? 115. I've got to find a good way to get to 120. Which there's ways to do that. And over time, we need to have like 20 Rajput given, you know, of uh, territory so I can bring them all up. We're at six. Let's go and do garrison size. No discipline among these, though I would like that. And I'd like that. I'm really more not I'm really not concerned about this New Zealand territories. I'm more concerned about this coast and that coast. 
which is why I'll probably be hopping as fast as I can to get these two, then that one, and working my way down for him. Look at the Ottomans. Have, have they taken Moscow? No, Moscow's here. So they've gone deep into what was Lithuania there too. Okay. Okay, now let's take a look at the HRE. The HRE is in religious peace. So they got the Tree of Westphalia. Anything here? Uh, Vilsa. Yep, we're at 30. Technically, I need one more. Karor has been changed over. Let's go ahead and get uh, Ujjain, which is my capital, which is kind of important. Three core, uh, core constructions ongoing, but I don't have really any rebels. Eugene is the worst. But it's very important he becomes, you know, one of ours. Manpower's at 100,000. I think... Gara and Vijanagar decided to declare this war here on their own. I'm going to have to probably fight Gorka. Right here, with Imperialism to fight Gara. Uh, that's kind of how I see that one going down. Is he one of the last ones, though? Yeah, that's the last thing for that, so that's not a big deal. We'll reclaim this. There'd be a little bit more, actually. You have at least 125 discipline. That's what we need to be looking after. What will get me 125 discipline? So that gives me five more. It's, so I'm going to have to get offensive and quality with two of these remaining ideas. Which isn't that big a big idea, big a deal because it's four more to go. Um, Where's this institution at? Eugene's got it. It's probably going to cost me an arm and a leg. Maximum promoted cultures. We don't really need to be doing anything right now. Rude relations, tolerance of the heretics, and idea cost minus 10%, though. That's pretty nice. We do that. Land attrition gives me land force limit. Up fifty percent, so I'd be able to hold uh, considerable number of troops. Yeah, I'd be able to hold like eighty at that point. You 
He's getting a hundred per year. And I'm only getting 55, but that's okay. I'd rather him go quicker. Should be drilling. Technically, nobody owns this section of the Himalayas, so, well, nobody's going to get it. There's one, two, three nations touching it. And they're just kind of decided, nope, nobody gets it. You know, after global trade, though, is manufactories. I have like one manu one or two manufactories. I don't really have much. I need to start doing them. But I really need to drop that inflation, too. So economic will probably be my next idea set, just to get to yearly inflation reduction. So if he gets any of these gold provinces like he's supposed to, he should start giving me a considerable amount. There's Pendarem. Send another guy there. Marriage bonds. How old is my guy? He's 67. My next guy is not very good. It's a 131. Sunni Zelts and Eugene. just came over. Uh, Dijat's going to cost way too much. Um, Ilchapur. Yep, now this is Hindu. Minus 10, even with that tyrannical ruler. Uh, morale of armies guy. Yeah, I'm not going to make a lot of money, but what do you do, right? Definitely don't think I can reach up here. Can I reach out to here? Nope. How far are you along? 780, and you're only getting grain. Money, Dundar gets some Leary Desire, and then their opinion changes. Yeah, that's the better of the two options. It's wasteful if I do it the other way. Colonial range goes up, we get merchantmen. Only making 1.5. Oh my goodness. Nope, I'm not going to help you, Bengal, take too much more. You're already too strong.
Nope, not gonna help you either, Send. That's how I go to war with Mamluks in the Bengal. Go down here, quickly get all this, try to fight Bengal. If you can't beat Bengal, just quickly end the war. I mean, that's a way to do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Twelve and a half years ahead. Rotha Riders. Gain two prestige. Yeah, we gotta try to make money any way we can. Take a look at us and our rivals. Bengal being the biggest one, 84,108 force limit. Me and my ally of, of Vijanagar, yeah. Vijanagar took some more territory too, so he's just not taking Thana, which would guarantee him a way in. Hard to declare war for reconquest of Monger, which is where? I don't know. Um, Yarkon wouldn't come in. Vijanagar would. Mawari, Australia, which isn't going to be super helpful. Interest per annum. Hopefully it won't become a thing. Is that 980? Forming Barat requires quite a bit more. We're kind of like halfway there on him. Do you have any allies? Char uh, Sharja, which is this guy. I should probably I could probably start doing some wars for uh you know going out there and doing money. Mawar never, uh, excuse me, Malwa doesn't consider me a rival anymore. Yep, he's taking some more. All I gotta do is put, like, get Garwal. Fifteen professionalism. Uh, nothing good out of all those. We're still not making a whole lot of money. Sometimes you wish you didn't have gold provinces. I know I do. We're going to hold off on doing any more conversions.
thing is all my forts are in good positions. I mean, they're meant to stop the hold the enemy back for long enough. I think he went to working on yeah he went on working on this eastern coast Ahariri so he's focusing completely on uh, New Zealand first just like we're focusing on western Australia Weirdly, nobody's come over here. That's farther away from me anyway. Portuguese Louisiana has it. Portuguese Mexico, that's weird. Crappy thing is there's gold over here. Like, and I know there's gold. I want the gold. Do that. Land attrition. Hired adventurers. Let's take a look at... Uh, National Manpower Modifier plus 10%, I guess. That's going to go up even higher. We're at 82 troops. Possible. I would just like to know how this would destabilize him. Maybe because it would hurt his stability, maybe, to be fighting somebody. Thing is, if we fought Bengal, it would take his 73, and really, I don't have but 40. So it's really 93 to his 97. Then you gotta consider in like, Sind has a little bit. I'm sure Yarkand has, you know, not a lot, but a little bit too. I can't afford new troops. One innovativeness. Pretty sure my innovativeness is not amazing. 18.4. It's making it to some areas. Delian Separatists, yes, that's nice. Oh wait, no, it may not be. Go sit them inside of Del the old Delhi capital.
Promote the nobility. Seek their approval. Then fish. Okay, these guys are at 50. Use that. Recruit the minister. Bring them up to 100. There you go. Getting as much as I can out of them, right? Can't promote another one. Go plus 30 there. Stability dropped just as I did that. Um, new deity. I'm going to go with the national tax modifier, Surya. Except that he's trying to take down that cat that uh province there. He's enlisting. Advisor maintenance is what we're going to have to lower, lower ourselves on here. Okay, which way are you going to go? Go towards Itawa. Minus 25 there. Bengal has announced this as our rival. Don't think you're going to win that. Yeah, he's going to just throw all of his men on it. So, knocked him down. Let's give something to the Rajputs. Their military leader left. It was for this guy. I need you to find gold. Like, I'm highly, I'm very serious about this. Like, they can find gold. Seen them do it. He still has one, two, three, four provinces before he's willing to move to the mainland, I'm sure. This guy's a one, three, one. Zero twos, uh, three. There goes at least a royal marriage. Maybe we'll have an heir before long. Increasing our mercantilism doesn't have a huge impact, honestly. Tech trade in Gujarat. It actually increases.
Waiting on Menang to get done. What's this guy make now? 0.18. Is he still receiving subsidies? Local tax modifier plus 20%. We'll lose that. Um, yeah, we're not transferring subsidies. We're not doing subsidies for them anymore. He went on up here to Taranga. So at least he's able to do it on his own. Could be not wasting two on this right here. Um, I guess since I'm not doing anything with them, let's drop that. Make some money, so that's worth it. Let's go ahead and drop your army. You go for drilling. 5141 and a military leader who is probably this guy down here. Yeah, he's not really needed to go look at the world too much anymore. He's got eight troops. Three ships there. Another further nine. We're at 968. 972. Do this one next. Should get it done in 1617, uh, 1617, unless something very nice happens. Really rather him do this because of the tropical. It's going to drop local settler increase by 10. One more month. Should get it. There goes Manang. So another colonist down here. Okay. He's going up by like so much on his own. I just need to give him the, uh, the head start he needs. Because if he can take over all of this stuff and start getting on this stuff here, he'll go by very fast. Truce with Delhi is over. I need to be thinking about doing that war. Let's take a look at our rival Delhi. 753. He has nothing. Jumping quick. That's going to be the name of the game in the next one. As I get our troops ready to go. Alright guys. When we come back... We're going to yeah declare this war here with our 20-year increase. Then we'll probably go try to fight Sind. I wish the Mamluks wouldn't join in if I just did that. Could try this. Yarkand and Sind. Janigar joining in. I get two allies that way. So we'll see. All right, guys. Appreciate you all so much for watching. For, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check the link for Discord in the description below. And I will see you all next time.